In the last video, we talked about proof by contradiction and we actually asserted that one of the most influential and most of the one of the most critical uh, theorems, which was that the square root of two is not rational. And if you haven't watched that video, then you might want to go back and see how that works because we will be using that uh, numerous times throughout the course in order to prove uh, several other theorems. In this video, I want to talk about ordered fields. Ordered, ordered fields. So fields, just as they normally are, uh, don't actually encapsulate all, um, you know, all creatable uh, sets. Only certain amount of uh, sets can be given the name of fields. And how do we know that? Well, we spent a long uh, well, with, well, a lot of time, sorry, not long, a lot of time um, defining what fields are. And we know that if something follows the nine axioms that I talked about in the previous lectures, then we would call that, uh, the, the, well, the, we, would, we would be forced to call that a field. If you haven't watched that and if you don't know what I'm saying, then you might want to go back and watch my field axioms video and then and go in order uh, from that video on in order to come all the way to ordered fields. Because if you don't understand that material, you won't be able to successfully understand ordered fields. So in this video, I, I want to spend time talking about what ordered fields are. So I'm just going to give you the definition. So that what is the definition of ordered ordered fields. So we have to let F, so let F be a field. Now F, so our field will be called, will be called ordered, ordered, if a subset P so if a subset P exists in F, so in mathematical uh, language, so th there, there exists a P which is a subset of our field. So th what is P? Think of P as the positive numbers, as the positive numbers. So, so if if you have a field, then then a field will be called an ordered field if there exist some sort of you know positive numbers. And now, if you if you you know research online or or if you read some sort of real analysis uh, book, then you will find out that some weird fields can be ordered. However, the main one that you want to think about is the reals, the the real field, uh, the real numbers. Um, that's the easiest way. And, and, and that's how you get the intuition of what ordered fields are. So uh, the, any anytime we talk about about fields, a uh, easier way of, you know, imagining and actually understanding what I am saying is just apply that material to the real numbers. So, so to, to repeat myself, let F be a field and we will call that field an ordered field if there exists some sort of positive subset in the field and which, which, which satisfies the following satisfies the following axioms, following axioms. So the first one is, so I'm just gonna, there are three, three, and I'm just gonna talk about all three of them down here. So the first one says that if X and Y are an element of that subset, so P, think about positive, numbers. So if X and Y are positive, then if you add them, if you were to add them, then their product, well, not, okay, anytime I say product, don't think about uh, multiplication, just think about the result. Their result will be in the positives. So X plus Y will be in the positives. Number two, if, if X and Y, if X and Y were, were, 
in the elements of the positive numbers, then if I were to multiply x with y, then th th their product, now you can think about multiplication, will be, will be in the positives. The final one, and in fact the most important one, will be, will be, um, it's, well it's called trichotomy. Now, this will be called ordered addition, so OA. This will be called ordered multiplication, so OM. The last one is called ordered trichotomy. So th th what, what does this mean? So for each, so for all X, so well for actually, let me just write it. For, for, for each X in, 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 the, in the field, only one, only one can be possible. Possible. So what, what am I talking about? So there are three types of possibilities. So we, we, we have one and then two and then three, three. So the first one is that either so for any x, so if 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 your field was some sort of, some, some sort of blob and and you were to take any x in 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 this field, then x is either an element of p. So if you want to relate that to the real numbers, either it's positive or x is equal to zero. Actually, I should put that at the end. So or x is equal to zero. Or negative x is an element of the positives. So if, if I were to give you an, an example, let's just look at the reals. Let's just, I don't have space to draw. Okay, so let's just look at the reals. We know that th if, if, if this is zero, then everything here will be positive. We don't have to worry about that. So if you take five, five, five is an element of p. If you take a, 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 a thousand, a thousand is an element of p. Now, if you if if you have a negative number, if you have a negative number, negative seven, negative seven is not an element of p. But we said that for any given x, it falls in one and only one of these categories. So it well, if I choose negative seven, it can it's it's not zero, it, it it's not positive. Then it's it's negative is positive. So what do I mean by that? This says that if you have an X, just put a negative in front of it, then then you will be in the positives. So if I have a negative seven, if I put a negative at the front, this is equal to seven, which we know is positive. So this encapsulates all of the positives. This uh, the section of trichotomy encapsulates all of the negatives and this in incorporates zero. So th th any given X uh, is positive. Well, it's, 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 it falls in one of these categories. So any field that, you know, follows all three of these axioms will be given the name of ordered fields. And just so you know, just to be clear, this, this, the third one, the one that actually is one of the most important one is called tri, trichotomy. I hope this video was helpful.